that everything you know and you believe about exercise and nutrition and take that into account if I said to you, most likely if you want to make more progress and feel better about the results that you get, you probably need to eat more and you need to exercise less. So that's all I have to say, you can go now. Simple solution, and it's very, very true, if you now insert between the lines. So you need to eat more higher quality foods. And if you do that and focus on that, there's less room anyway and less desire for the lower quality foods. And if you're exercising, and we hear a few excuses here, commonly, about exercise, and one of those on high on the list is I don't have time. I can't find the time, and, and that all goes with not just the time for exercise, but the time to change clothes and the time to shower and be back in the Superman outfit I had on before I exercised and get that all done. So time we understand, but one of the things that we know better than we ever used to, and there is a gender bias we'll talk about, is that it can take much less time than you probably think that it needs to take if you do it right. So it's about high quality exercise as well. Not high quantity, but high quality. And so if we tweak those two things, both the exercise and the nutrition, you can be more satisfied with the food that you eat. You can be less time-wise consuming your day with exercise time and still get the results that you want and feel good about.